Hi lovely, welcome to the wig room at Finger Coma. My name is Francine and I am the creative director here. About a week ago, we shared a video after that viral video with Just Witty that was on Dear Future Wifey podcast. Her finger coma unit fell off and we wanted to just share a quick video to show you guys how to make sure that you're, that doesn't happen to you. And we had a comment in the, in the comments from a customer named Carmen Harris. I'm not sure actually if she was a customer or if she was just a curious YouTube viewer. She asked us to show how you could, um, how you could install our units with no leave out, with the illusion of a middle part, with maybe a, a V part. She might not have asked for all of those specifics, but clearly she was asking uh, for us to show ways that you can install your finger comb unit. So in response to her video, I mean, in response to her request, here we are going to show you guys how to install the finger comber elongated fro curl unit with no leave out and the illusion of a middle part. So guys, I also want to mention that every day we get so many, like a ton of emails and DMs asking different questions about our units. So we try to answer those as best as we can, but we felt that it would be a really great idea if you guys could make your requests about things that you might want to know and then instead of just answering one person like we ordinarily do we'll just make the, as many videos as we can because if you have the question it's more than likely that some, at least somebody else has the same question so send us your emails send us your dms ask your questions and we will do our best to just come back with a bunch of video responses Thank you guys for um, just riding with us. Thank you for ordering with us. Thank you for just all the love that you show us. And yeah, so stay tuned. So first let's take this off so we can show you how to put it back on properly. The unit comes with these accordion clips in the front and in the back and it also has adjustable straps we didn't have to do anything to adjust them to fit on her head so you're just going to take the combs in the front and as you can see we have no leave out here you're going to install the unit with the combs going into your base which is either cornrows or your hair pulled back or if you have on a stocking cap and you're gonna, you know, do that in the front and the back, and then just get an idea of how you want it to fall on your head. Once you get an idea uh, of where you want it to fall, we are doing just the illusion of a middle part here. You just start little by little, combing little head pieces of hair around the edges. These little bits of hair that we have around the edges, what we're creating is something called permatease. And a lot of wigs come with it. We don't provide the wigs with permatease because some people don't want that. So, but what we're doing here, we're just creating permatease around the edges and in the part and taking pins to secure the wig down because again, you don't want your wig falling off because it's not properly secured. When you're comfortable with how secure it is, then you can just take your time and just back comb the edges a bit around the areas that are gonna be exposed. What I also like to do is take a little pin, uh, just a hairpin, bobby pin, and sort of tuck one side back, just so it gives you just some facial exposure, expose your pretty face and keep that hair back on one side. Um, it really depends on what you like, but I always like to leave uh, a good bit of your face exposed. I don't feel like hair should be covering up your whole face, but if you want to do that, you can. And again, we're just taking our time and backcombing these little areas to make everything just look natural 
and real and just softening up that edge. You want to take your time to do that like the first time that you're installing the unit so that when you take it off, you don't have to do that again. And after that, you can just, you know, be ready to go. And this is about the look that we came up with her, a middle part illusion with no leave out. Um, again, I'm just going back in and just um, softening up that edge uh, a bit more.